Yeah, so, so far for the month of July, it's been pretty warm and pretty humid out there, you may have noticed, but we have only seen actually 10 days that have been at or even above average for this time of year for the month of July. Now, the warmest day has been about 94 degrees. We got that on July 1st and then on July 4th, and then the coolest day was actually on the 19th when we only got to 80 degrees. So it was certainly cool that day. Now, when we take a look at the rainfall, we have actually actually kind of picked up a good amount of rain as we've gone throughout this month. If you remember the end of June, we kind of ended it with a lack of rainfall, but with so much rounds of rain we have seen lately, we have picked up close to a four inches of rain, so close to three tenths above average. Now when we compare this to what we saw last year, it's wetter than what we were at last year. Last year, most of us were experiencing a moderate drought and a lack of rainfall, but when we look at the average of high and low temperatures together, the average temperatures is actually slightly cooler than last year. The average last year was 84 degrees. So while it may seem hot outside right now, the main reason why is really that high humidity making it feel more like close to 100 degrees. If you want to know more, you can head on over to whnt.com.com where you can read more from the article.